Hi, my name is Matthew Stebbins. I'm a waterfront luxury specialist with My House Realty, and this is nine tax breaks that every first time home buyer must know. Stay tuned. Hi, welcome back. The first thing is mortgage interest deduction with tax credits. Uh, that is an awesome deal that the IRS does, is uh, deducting all your mortgage interest off your tax bill. So that is one thing that will help you out. Let's see, last year I spent about $7,000 in interest alone on my mortgage, and um, so that's $7,000 off your tax bill. Number two is the mortgage credit certification, and uh, that is for people who are first-time home buyers that don't make a lot of money but uh, still have the first time home buyer credits and so that will actually take your bill directly down from the amount of money you've actually earned over the years so it really instead of being a credit towards your uh, taxes it'll be actually a deduction on the amount of money you made over uh, the last year and so that kind of helps you with your overall tax bill number three is your mortgage points deduction and so when you have a higher interest rate you can pay points and uh, get your interest rate lowered well you can also deduct that from your tax bill number four is tax-free IRA withdrawals which you can put money down on your house or you can put money towards repairs so you don't get taxed on that especially if you're a first-time home buyer number five is the real estate tax deduction and what that will help you with is when you have all your real estate taxes that they will give you more of an opportunity to not pay so much. Number six, if you didn't know about, is home improvements. You uh, get to write off all your home improvements that you've done on the house since you've bought it, and so you can do it each year, which is really nice. Seven is just like number six, however, this is a home office deduction. That's pretty normal for most people, however, being a first time home buyer, you may not know about it. So use your office at your house for your business, you can write that off too. Number eight is home energy tax credits. Those are kick butt. Sometimes you buy solar, sometimes you just put in new insulation, sometimes you uh, put on a new roof. Some of those things are awesome because um, when you have a better home energy uh, ratings on some of your appliances or even um, you know you, the electronics and stuff, certain ones like big appliances, you can write it off. You usually get about up to 30%. Number nine is writing off your mortgage insurance as deduction. So mortgage insurance, you'll have to pay if you have over 80% loan to value. And uh, sometimes the cost of the mortgage insurance can be the price of a car payment, which that's a lot of money. So it's nice at the end of the year when you can write it off on taxes. Well, this has been nine tax tips that every first time home buyer should know about. And my name is Matthew Stebbins. Thank you very much for listening. Follow me on Facebook. Take care. Bye-bye.